Okay, so welcome to Review Monkey. We're going to review another drone now. This is the Hubson 502, the younger brother of the 501. It doesn't come with this case, but it's a case I use to store it in. Great for holidays or weekends away. This model comes with basic controller. You can get the one with the controller with the screen on if you wish. screen. It's alright. It goes off every now and then. Oh, is it? It's good to say battery. Just leave it pointing. Just point up a little bit. So I can edit that out. Anyway. So what we'll do, we'll connect the battery. Pretty standard battery connector. Battery just slots in there. The back of the drone. Power on. And I'll now turn on my controller. And I'll give them a moment to find each other and bind see it actually says there there's no satellites on the drone and it hasn't found the controller there you go it's found the controller now it's found the drone the drone's got a full battery controller's got a full battery set compass one the best way to set compass one is to turn around like an idiot so it says so it says set compass two the nose goes down and again turn around find compass 2 doesn't usually take as long okay before we fly I'm gonna just check I've got 11 satellites if I want to record footage I hold the record button in and that will start to flash telling me it's recording I must remember though to press it again before I turn things off or I won't save any of the recordings which is Quite annoying if you forget to do that. So to get the blaze to initialize I need to pull the sticks down like so. It's very windy so we'll see what happens. This could be a disaster. Still not sure. So we'll just try and hold it there. Not bad given it's windy the drone will try and hold position and it will probably wander a little bit you'll see it leaning into the wind. I'm going to take this opportunity to put my sunglasses on. Excuse if I trust this drone. Okay. And what I did there, I'm pushing this right stick in to give me more throw on the controls. So sport mode. And that means the drone will fly pretty fast. And remember we're recording this, so anytime I can do a pan or even press the record button and take a quick photograph, which is always handy. Now, really I'm fighting in this wind, I've got to say. Not liking it very much at all, but we'll keep going. Again, a white drone, not a problem in the sky because it just silhouettes and looks black when the sun's behind it, so you never lose sight of it. I notice the camera is picking up that wind, it is really windy and the drone is just sitting there, I'm not even holding the sticks, I mean, for a 70 pound drone, that is incredible. The GPS and the speed controllers are constantly fighting to hold position, really good. Let's do another bit of flight. Now I'm do is bring it forward for the camera so even though it's windy just to see how stable this drone is even in a breeze so now I'm not touching the controls as I will prove I'm losing a bit of height I'll put some throttle on yeah it is fighting in the wind but in fairness still controllable 
obviously altitude is changing a little bit with the breeze or the gust. Again, not touching the sticks. Just leaving the drone to do its thing. What I'll do now is a bit more forward flight. Keeping it a bit low just so I can control it in this breeze. And surprisingly fast as well, just like a small drone. Right, I'm going to bring it for a landing. In fact, I'm going to try a return to home function. So on this drone, I can fly it away. Now it's very windy, so it's not going to be accurate. But if I press this button here, return to home, it should bring the drone back to where we started, all by itself. Let's see how this works out in this wind. So just so you know, I'm not touching any of the sticks now, it's doing it all itself. And I'll keep the control there so you can see. That's about what meter off where we started. Yeah. Not bad at all. If I'd lost the drone, I'd be very happy with it coming back to that point. Right, I think that's it for now. I will come back to this drone later when we've got another battery in. So thanks for watching and keep tuning in to Review Monkey. Did you record all that, Jimmy?